That's right, and Barclays Bank is being targeted because the company owns 97% of Third Energy, who have plans to carry out fracking close to North York Moors National Park. So we're part of a group called People and Planet, which is a network of students across the UK uh, and campaigning on largely environmental issues. Um, we're here today to protest against Barclays because they own or own a majority stake in a company called Third Energy, who are pursuing exploratory uh, fracking in Yorkshire and in Sheffield soon as well. And for those that don't know, what, what, is, what is fracking? So fracking is a means of extracting shale gas from deep underground. So what happens is water is poured into the ground to break up the rocks underneath and gas comes out and it's collected. But it's an incredibly wasteful form of collecting energy in that a lot of the gas leaks and this is very problematic in that the gas is methane which is very, very damaging for the environment, which is part of the reason why we're opposed to it. Fracking is very damaging to communities. Um, there's been reports of earthquakes in the UK and in the US, and especially in the US, like, there's been a lot of contamination of water supplies. Like, a lot of people um, got very ill because fracking's happened near to them. It's destroyed farms. It's just a way of ruining communities, basically. I also spoke to James Parker, who is also a part of People and Planet, and I asked him why he thought that this issue was so important. Government, the government, uh, the UK government have just um, passed a law which means that it's legal to frack in national parks, which I think is madness because um, I'm a Sheffield local boy and um, I've been speaking to lots of people today who are very angry that the beautiful peak districts could be um, fracked and made into a landscape of oil uh, gas extraction rather than the beautiful scenery it is. And what would that mean for Sheffield, do you think, in the, in the late future? It's a very short term view, you know, we're seeing. We want short-term profit rather than long-term. You know, we haven't got much countryside in the UK. We've got these national parks, which we've des which were designed to um, make safe, so that we could have them for generations um, beyond. Um, but instead, we're, we're looking at the short term, and then like, you know, we're not going to have any anywhere to play with in the future. It's you know, it's madness. Okay, so Barclays own 97% shares in a company called Third Energy, um, which invest, which um, are planning to frack in Yorkshire. So it's a local issue for local people. Um, energy and pollution issues are often seen as you know, something which happens elsewhere in a different country. Um, but we're bringing this to local local Sheffield folk today, saying you know this could be on your doorstep. This might be happening in the Peak District very soon. We managed to get a statement from Barclays and they said that through global natural resources investments, Barclay has a majority stake in Third Energy, which is a British business with a history of investment and good corporate citizenship in North Yorkshire. Third Energy has been drilling, developing and producing gas in the region for over 20 years with an excellent environmental and safety record. They continue saying, we are conscious of the concerns of local communities and other groups over potential environmental and community impacts, which we take seriously and will continue to monitor. We have worked closely with Third Energy to ensure their plans are compatible with our values and any future shale gas extractions activity will be subject to the full planning process, including environmental assessment and public consultation. I'm Shaman Freeman Powell in Sheffield Live Reports.